Well, considering the last time I made a video on Master Duel, it got over 3,000 views, let's try this again. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe and ring that bell for more. Hit the lever! I just don't understand why Yu-Gi-Oh is so shit. Why Why are people just able to summon 60 monsters first turn? What happened, man? Like, well, what changed? Like, why? Why is it just constant summoning when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh anymore? This is still this guy's first fucking turn, and he's still just s summoning monsters out the ass. Just, it just keeps going. Now he's gonna link or attribute synchro <laughs> summon. Go ahead. I'm gonna go back to playing Pokemon. I'll just go ahead and leave my controller on the ground for a little bit. Did all that to throw all four of his monsters out, by the way. Might as well go ahead and take a nap, player, while we're here waiting. Might as well, right? So those clips you just saw is from someone who clearly doesn't know what Yu-Gi-Oh has become since it first began in 2002. And that's the key to this video. That's what I want you to remember while listening to my sexy voice with no popping in mic this time. Remember this simple phrase, drill it into your skull. Welcome to 2022 Yu-Gi-Oh, folks. This is what Yu-Gi-Oh has been for a while now. Now, with that being said, as I said in my last video, shitting on Master Duel, I have been playing competitively since 2008. I've watched Yu-Gi-Oh! evolve from a turn simply being, I summon a monster and maybe set two in the back row and pass. Yu-Gi-Oh! is now, I'm going to build my board of negates and big monsters and ask if you can break my board. If you can't, you lose, go to next game, GG no re. Oh wait, there is no game two, there is no side decking, because Konami made Master Duel single format only. And honestly, I feel bad for you people, because that's not even real Yu-Gi-Oh. In the real game, at least you can side deck. At least you can choose to go first and build your own board. On top of that, you can actually see what competitive Yu-Gi-Oh is like instead of getting pounded into the dirt because someone is playing Dragon Link while you're playing whatever the fuck Sacred Beast deck this dude was playing. And this guy was pissed about the Dragon Link player making a dog shit board. The board that player built was awful. Since when does Dragon Link play Archlord Christia? And better yet, why was this guy who posted the video playing Wicked Dreadroot and what looks like a Sacred Beast deck? At least play something you stand a chance with. Play Eldritch or even Flunderies. Which leads me to my next point, and I have to be bluntly honest here. I feel like a lot of y'all are playing decks that aren't even remotely good by 2022 Yu-Gi-Oh standards. And it isn't your fault. You don't know what the meta is. If you aren't watching a YouTube video and just playing casually, at the same time, Konami should have known that this game would attract people that may not keep up with Yu-Gi-Oh 24-7 like some of us in the competitive crowd do. That's also why I made my commenters don't understand Master Duel video, because some of you don't fully understand the meta and are getting dunked on for it. And it's sad, but it goes to show why Master Duel is shit, and why it's slowly dying. The game has yet to get a frickin' ban list. Why would you ever touch this game when again, as I have said millions of fucking times at this point, just play on Dueling Book or Dueling Nexus or EDO Pro. It's a much better experience, trust me. Also, no offense to the Sacred Beast player that I was poking fun at in this video, it's all in good fun, I'm just busting your balls, pimp. So at the end of the day, I think that Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel has a lot that it needs to fix. It needs a ban list. It needs better seasons and not the shit show that the Xyz Festival was. And you need to have match play where people can side deck just like you can in the real game. Have TCG and OCG ban lists separate. Don't have just one long ban list that isn't even the same as the real game. And just make the game better overall make it so that people don't feel like they have to buy things from the storefront don't make people grind for four hours again you have to make the games more accessible to everyone i'm not going to grind for hours on end to get a top tier deck when i have all the cards at my disposal on dueling nexus or edo pro so guys please let me know in the comments below what you think am i totally off kilter am i just totally wrong am i an idiot i don't know i don't know but these are my opinions on Master Duel, and I, I think that I am kind of in the right here because it's just a really bad game, and like I said in my last video, it makes the old DS games look leagues and above better. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you 
in the next video.